squash, egg, milk pow powder, unsalted, melted butter, yeast, brown sugar, salt, condensed, condensed milk, and the last ingredient, flour. Because flour is the main ingredient. Okay guys, now I'm going to put the ingredients. First goes the milk. Okay. Then it's the butternut squash. Very good. Slowly. Next, the butter. I know guys, it looks very, it looks salty, it looks like it's we already added salt because we already did, but it looks very crumbs. Okay, I think that's enough. Now I need to pour the flour, that's the next ingredient, but we need to shake it. guys i back but this is so hard but i have a bubble gum brain that's why i'm just trying to do it because i'm just a kid <clears throat> i think that's enough okay guys i already have flour and now i have to scatter it over the table I, so i think that's enough take out all the flour and then i'm going to get this that i mix I hope I can show my mom now she can help me. Come on, let's knead it. Let's knead it together, okay? now but I can't scratch it because my hands are covered with this I don't want my hair to smell like food okay keep going can you do it by yourself now can you do it okay right. I'm going to make it like sure circle shape and guys always remember in this sticky part ask your mom 
never use it on your butt by yourself. So guys, I smelled it and it smelled so familiar. Like what? Like maybe, or maybe Spanish bread. Okay guys, I wish I can still do more, but I greased this bowl, this bowl with oil so the dough won't stick, but you cannot see it because it's so clear. And now I'll put it in. I'm going to cover this with a cloth because I'm already holding it and let it rise for a bit, like one hour. So I hope you like this video and subscribe to our channel, but this is not goodbye. Next part of our video and look what happened to the dough. This is what happened because it's already been one hour. See, it's mutant. Now we need to punch it up the middle to let up air. Mm. Now I'm going to put it on the table and start rolling it with the rolling pin. But first I'll put it somewhere better. Yeah, here's a better place. <coughs> Sorry. done making circles but now I need to make cuts okay everyone or should I say guys I'm going to ask my aunt Beck to help me use the very sharp scissors with these I also feel hungry so I just want to eat them all but still it's not time to eat them so so he so I'm going to to get each one and she's going to help me cut the parts with okay. a very sharp scissors. So what are you going to do first? First, take a ball then flatten it. Okay, and then what are we going to do now? Use the scissors okay. to cut Let's it. Hold but, together. Let's but, hold together. But still, you okay, need to ask an adult. Cut on the bottom first and then next. The left side. And then to the right side. Right side. It's like pie. And, and then on top. Okay? And then another. Like a flower. Right? I can do it on my own now. Okay, you can do it now? Okay. Alright. Okay, to the left side. Whoa! It's like a mango. Okay, very good. And that's it. And the top. Okay. Very, very good. good. And then put that like one flower. here. Okay. Sorry. I no, we take it out the table. Mm. I have to do it carefully because I 
worked so hard to make the flower. cover all the dough with the cloth in 40 minutes. Now I am going to poke the bread but before that I am going to brush the sticks with oil. Now let me start poking it. them all. Now it's time to brush them with egg wash. Okay guys, I'm already done with putting these, but now I need to put something. I but now I'm going to put it in the in the oven for 15 minutes. So guys, after 15 minutes, this happened to the bread. Here you go. This is already done, but I haven't put the butter yet. So I'm going to put some butter. Okay guys, it is the final step. Finally, we're almost done. So now I need to put this. This it is called pecans. Now let me put the pecans on. And now we're done. Thank you guys for watching my channel. Subscribe and like. And share the channel with your friends. Bye!